bro. First off, I read more books than a lot of you motherfuckers type shit. And guess what? I'm a black man. Fuck you talking about? Look, y'all know niggas ain't supposed to be reading books. So I got to share this video with y'all before the government take me out of the shit. You know what I'm saying? We got the... Hey, don't be thinking we out here reading look, little books. Look, when I tell you we got books sticking in some of you bitches, I ain't lying. I ain't lying. And you know we keep that Bible on us. You know we read that Bible every day. You don't read the Bible every day. Your problems are too big for me. I know y'all thought that was all. That is not all, folks. Y'all go got some over here on the chill. Y'all heard about D. Gregory? That's probably one of my top three books. Black Liberation. I love that book, too. The only thing I didn't like about it, look. <sighs> Why y'all white folks had to do it like that for? Huh? My grandma and them didn't deserve that. And to, to be honest, it's still unconsciously there. I'm on to y'all. 1984, that was really that thing too. It was um, some guy in the 40s, he was making predictions about what's going on today. I know some of y'all don't like to pay all the bills as men. That's weird as fuck to me, but you are who you are. Who the fuck am I to judge? If you get this book, it's called The Way of a Superior Man. He gonna tell you, nigga, you definitely supposed to pay bills. Uh-huh. It literally explains you the only way a woman's gonna be able to flourish in her feminine energy if you give her certainty. If a woman is uncertain, she will never be completely feminine. Anytime you give a woman your job, any parts of your job, it's, it's impossible for her to flourish your feminine energy. Yep, learn that shit too. Look, the African unconscious, right? The African unconscious. Let me sum this up for y'all. Everything came from niggas. I'm a mama. Look, the stress prescription. Look, baby, if you're a baby mama, please get this. If you're a baby mother and your daddy ain't, your baby daddy ain't doing shit, get this, boy. Look, you need it. And a lot of us ain't have no daddy. It's okay. Because in 1984, they actually tell you why you ain't got no daddy. Since you don't have a father, you need to grab that emotional intelligence 2.0. You know, lack of a daddy make a nigga emotional and violent. Trust me, I know. You know what I'm talking about? Tell you about that limbic and that um, cerebral cortex, motherfucker. Self education! You know Martin Luther King, you got you gotta always fuck with some Martin Luther King we're talking about. Cause Martin Luther King gonna let you know, look, boy, you're never the same level as these people. Matter of fact, your level is so much higher, they gotta keep you at a level lower than them to make themselves feel better. Read and don't judge me, you'll get what I mean. This is a book called Wiser. This is like this big this book thick as hell. I ain't gonna lie. I love this book though. This teach you how to become wise and show you how the whole human brain work and everything, bro. I literally know much so much about the brain. I know like if you get injured in a certain spot of your head, I know it can stop you from gaining memory, but you can remember every incident before the accident. But after the accident, you can't remember shit after that 30 minutes. You just be like, it's yesterday again.